April last year, I was at Gersten Down Hill Climb near Salisbury, mostly to see these Austin 7s, but I always enjoy hill climb for a really eclectic paddock. Uh, you know, the motorbikes, trikes, you know, kit cars, classics, uh, modern hatchbacks and sports cars. But I also stumbled upon the most bonkers one-off hill climb special I've ever seen in my life. The defining feature is it's got a four-cylinder engine as normal, but instead of a turbo or a supercharger, it's got a gas turbine that then generates pressurized air into the engine. So it makes all the lovely whooshy gas turbine noises. Just the startup sequence is quite a spectacle. Uh, when it's running, there's this big boost four-cylinder race engine noise, as well as that gas turbine. Uh, it's got a blown diffuser and a lot of downforce. It's got power to spare, so you know it can run a lot of downforce. I heard it's also got four-wheel drive as well, so you know, quick off the line. In the description, I've linked to a couple of videos on Tony Bray's channel. He's got an interview which goes into you know, how it was built and a bit of a demonstration of it and all the plumbing. He's also got a startup sequence and he's also got onboard footage on his channel. There's also a link to a film from a channel called Zip. It's at Prescott Hill Climb and it's a nice crisp footage. It was a wet day so you can see where the exhausts come out. You can also see all four wheels spinning up as it slithers trying to get the tyres warm and the launch. So great audio on there as well so that's another one well worth watching. His previous car was a Morris Minor from his mum, which he tuned and then put an MGB engine and then turbocharged it and then a V8 and turbocharged it and broke lots of records. Uh, that used to pop and bang with anti-lag, which was the ancestor to this system. So an extremely talented engineer and driver and a rabbit hole I very much enjoyed uh, running down. There's another video with more on the Austin 7s and one which was sort of my day out walk around. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed that and uh, see you in the next one.